now that the dash is nice and clean I'm going to be using C6 matte dash by G-Technic what this is going to do is give you a layer of UV protection as well as abrasion resistance this product is also antibacterial this is a really easy product to apply you're just going to spray it directly onto your clean dry surface and then you're going to wipe away uh, any residue with a nice clean short pile of microfiber towel this can also be used on door card material, vinyl plastics, and rubberized finishes as well. This stuff is a bit pricier at $20 for a 100 milliliter bottle, but uh, I think it's pretty worth it, especially in the summertime. Now it's time to get these exterior plastics cleaned up and restored. We got tons of bugs we're dealing with. It's very faded and has sap and whatnot on it from the trees above. It's got some weird spots here on the back. Hopefully we can get those evened out. Now the door handles and the above trim along the top is pretty porous. It should take really well to the treatment. The door trim on the other hand isn't really porous at all. so. Out of curiosity, I'm going to apply it to that as well and see how it takes. Now to restore the plastic trim, I'm going to be using C4 by G-Technic. This is a permanent trim restorer that has durability up to two years. It's for use on all exterior trim and it restores the trim to as new condition. It comes with instructions and four little pads. I've already used the previous three pads, but it comes with four. Another option for applying G-Technic C4 is a foam block applicator with a butter soft suede or a microfiber. I mean, as you can see, it looks just incredible after you're done. This side of the car is done. I've already done the mirror on this side, but I haven't done the trim or door handles on this side yet. Now the final step after you apply the C4 is to go back afterwards and buff it off with a microfiber towel.
I've decided that I'm going to leave the cowl the way it is um, so that we have a comparison. But look at that, you guys. These plastics look absolutely amazing. Now, if your car has a crap load of plastic like this one does, it's going to take a whole bottle of that C4 trim restore. All right, guys. The owner of this vehicle doesn't ever wash it or anything, so we'll see how this holds up against the elements. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.